There is two things that we're gonna do in this video. First of all, I wanted to farm Zriachi to see how much money we can make and what kind of rare items uh, cultists on the island and the Zriachi drop. And secondly, I managed to unlock a secret animation of Lightkeeper, which most of you probably haven't even seen and didn't know about. So stay tuned for that. I'm gonna show this animation. Well, I'm gonna show the whole raid. Uh, when that happened a uh, few minutes into the video, so stay tuned. If you watched my streams recently, you would realize that I was using ExpressVPN for the past few months and they were kind enough to sponsor this video and I could go on and on and tell you how great they are uh, for different reasons for which they truly are, but I think I'm gonna make it more simple and I'll just tell you the reasons why I specifically use this VPN. And the first reason is really simple, uh, ExpressVPN is available on PC, on your laptop, on your phone, you literally open the app, there is one button you can click you click this button, you connect to the VPN, and off you go. It's as simple as that. And the other reasons, I really spend a lot of time online. I love to watch YouTube videos, movies, I upload videos to YouTube. And a really important thing for me is the speed of my internet. And ExpressVPN doesn't throttle your speed, so you can watch all the movies you want in multiple tabs, upload videos, and you will get exactly the same speed with VPN as without. That's very important for me. And the last reason probably is very simple. Um, Safety. Whenever you browse, uh, all the websites can see your IP addresses, your ISP, aka your uh, internet provider can see your history, and VPN makes sure nobody can access this information, and since they run their VPNs on RAM servers, they can't store this information physically, so after your session, it gets deleted. And this is more or less it, so if you want to check out ExpressVPN, our guy, our sponsor of the video, feel free to click the link in the description, and you will get three months of usage for free when you buy it using my link, and it also comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee, which means if you don't like the VPN for whatever reason, uh, you can get all of your money back without any problems within the first 30 days of usage. So, check them out. Right, let me see if maybe I can uh, snipe some of the other guys now. Oh, bro, he got both. He got the headwear and the mask. Got both of them. Uh, there was one on the left, but I've never seen the ones. Yeah, to you. There is like one to your left, but I've never seen the ones on the right. I can check for them if you want. You can you can protect me, bro. Yeah. You can protect. Yeah, in case they start coming up. <laughs> is that a new rig from cultists? Million, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same one. Uh, yeah, 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 sponsored, yeah. I think. This rig is actually really expensive, and if you sell it in the flea market, you can make around from 50 to around 110k per rig. So it's a good thing to grab. Yep. All right. You did kill him. Good. Bro, even in this weather you managed. Yeah, the scope helped and uh, uh, I changed some NVIDIA settings mm -hmm, too. Mm -hmm. I think that helped a little bit. You want me to record it from my end? No, no, it's alright. I mean, I, th I think that's fine. It's the sun, dude. The sun is supposed to be behind us, like behind you. Nice! I have no idea how you managed. Yeah, I'm gonna try something stupid. Like, I feel like I should be getting shot at right now. Typically when I would loot Zriachi, I would sell his SVD for around 200-250k as it came with 20 rounders and BS bullets and one stack of BS would sell for around 70k and at the end of the video I'm gonna calculate how much money we can make by selling his mask because it's extremely expensive on the flea market. Oh, and if you thought I forgot to show you the secret lightkeeper animation, don't worry, it's gonna be in the next raid. I think I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna move up to that rock now that we got him, so that way I can mm -hmm. see if our yep. friend decides to come back, okay? Oh, this one is butt naked. <gasps> He's got the skull mask, bro. Chat, can you check the skull mask price on the flea, please? Mm. 
Говори, раз пришел. Alright, I'm 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 at lightkeeper, so I guess you can shoot him. Зрячий, на связь. Зрячий. Так, все, иди отсюда. Yeah, he just tells me to back off. If somebody kills Zrachi while you're talking to the lightkeeper, he literally calls Zrachi, he, re he gets no response, and he tells you to back out. And apparently if you stay in his building for way too long, I think if you stay in his building for around a minute or so, you will be uh, missed and raid, like you will literally just, just die in there. Alright, now I'm gonna go over here and get a different spot, so we'll watch see people coming towards the mm -hmm. beach. Just got so fucking fed up with running into people. Thermal every raid, dude. Just whatever. <laughs> now we're the ones with the thermal. Yep. Oh yeah, you can trade, dude. Balance. Perfect. Player on the rock. Balanced. Top right. Dude. Top right. Top right. You ducked right under it. I think I killed that guy, bro. <laughs> Got him? Yeah, I, I killed I killed the player, but he was like all the way on the um, in the woods. I'll just wait. I'll just wait for him. Oh, yeah, he's in the woods. Oh, that's his. Never mind. That's his calf. Wait, what the fuck? Two of them. Yeah, that's me, that's me. I'm next to the drop now. Apparently Skef found somebody. Apparently Skef found a dead body, bro. Yeah, I know Skef said like... I don't know, two dead Skefs. Kinda going towards the main road. Lay down. Someone shot that off, ran away. This is really weird. All of them are scabs. Like literally all of them. After I finished looting the supply crate, we safely extracted, and let's move to the grand finale of the video where I'll check the prices of the masks on the flea market and we can calculate how much extra rubles we managed to make. I completely forgot to mention how much money I make on average from running uh, and killing Zrachi. So I think roughly we were making around 200-250k from his SVD, um, 200k from grabbing the brand new rigs which we will buy on the flea market for like 50 100k and then I would sell 60 rounders on the flea and uh, suppressors from suppressors and sides from SVDs from cultists and I think I was making around 500k to a million on average per rate so 10 rates let's say six seven million just from usual items all right my stash is very messy but it's not gonna stop us from calculating our profits so I've got four Zrachi masks which are which you can wear as a hat that's how it looks like on your PMC hello And each of those hats sells for 100k, which is pretty cheap to be honest at the moment. I think you can sell it for much more, depending on the time. And if we sell it for 100k, the commission is only 5k, so let's say 100k profit. Um, so that's 400k in profit. Then we also have 3, 3, 9, 10. We've got 10 Zrechi masks, which are being sold for 400k each. I'm pretty sure you can sell them for a bit more, for like 500k. Depending on the time, once again, so let's say we, we sell them for 430 each. Commission is 50k, so let's say if we manage to sell it for a bit more, 400k from masks, that's 4 million from 10 masks. And on top of that, we've got 437 7 skull masks. Each of them is getting sold for a million at the moment. And if we sell one for a mil, our commission is 200k. So 
7 masks, 7 mil, 1.4, 5.6. So 5.6 million from selling the masks. And what's that in total? Like 10 million? I mean, I'm sorry, chat, I'm baked. You can you can do the calculation yourself if you want. But this is roughly how much money we can make from Zirachi. 10 million, 10 million rubles from um, running and killing Zirachi 10 times. If anybody wonders how we actually done that, me and Burr, my mod, we were selecting the same server in the launcher and we, we, we were joining the game uh, by solos, we were not in a team, just selecting the same server, saying 3, to 1, go, and we would always uh, load in the same game, he would kill uh, the boss and I would load the boss and then leave. So that was our strat. And thank you so much for watching the video and I will see you in the next one.